One of the easiest ways to get started with something is to go in and take a look and see what you can actually do with it. So we're on Scratch's website and we're going to download Scratch from here, but we're also going to be able to explore and change and play with the program itself. Uh, so to start off here, we're going to go to the Explore button at the top, and this is going to go open up anything that somebody's put online for us to freely use. Uh, so example, if I want to go to Simple Racing Engine here, I can do so, and I'm able to go through and play whatever's being played there and create it. So the project's loading up, and I can just hit this little green flag and start playing the game. The really cool thing about Scratch is that you can click on See Inside, and you can actually understand and see the code that was used to make this game. Not only code, but you can see all the sprites and the code associated with those sprites. And the really great thing is that because we have these options here, I can actually go through and I can change some of these things. So if I want to set the size instead of 1600%, uh, I can set it to 500% and remix it. And then it will update it. You do have to create an account to remix so you can see what the result of your code is. Uh, but you can really go through and play with that quite a bit. Uh, so that's a real quick intro to Scratch. Uh, what I really recommend doing is when you're on Scratch itself, just go through, explore the different types of games, and look at the code and see how they're done. You can live update and see how it affects what you do and how it works. In our next video, we're going to go through and talk about how to download Scratch.